Hello everyone, my name is Andrew Karasev. I continue the series of um, uh, Chain of Command in Dynamics 365 Financial Operations uh, X++ Sample Codes uh, and today we will take a look at uh, how to uh, implement a method wrapper for delete uh, method for the table. Uh, you should begin programming in five minutes, that's virtually what it will take. Why we are doing delete method? Let, let's take a look why. Uh, the answer is in Microsoft document. Here is the URL to this document and here is the uh, document name. And um, let's find the table. Okay, here is the uh, what you can do with the table methods. You can um, um, use chain of command for delete submit to workflow and caption methods. Now we go to Visual Studio and uh, here is uh, the class. Uh, you create the class in uh, your project. Right click, add, new item, code, class and give it a name. The name should be uh, um, should contain the table name uh, in my case, uh, sales table is the form and table name is uh, also sales table, so I have it sales table table and then you should have extension suffix at the end. Okay, so without any conditions you should uh, call next delete method um, and then um, here is how you retrieve the um, sales ID from the table buffer. So when you have sales ID you are free to to call your customization. In my case I select the um, uh, my um, custom table. The name of this custom table is this. And this is compliance table related to sales order. So and I, I call it for update you need to use this in order to delete the record and uh, if I have uh, the um, sales compliance record for the sales ID then um, I begin transaction and then delete the uh, record from my custom table and uh, then commit transaction I'm using version 8.1 in my demo uh, the uh, chain of command was introduced uh, with uh, 7.2 update 9. In your case, likely what uh, should be done is uh, you read sales ID uh, because this got to be the uh, alternate key for the um, sales table table. And then uh, instead of this code, you call your customization. You may call your custom class or you, you may you may do something like this uh, working with uh, the custom tables or working with the core tables or you na name it thank you for watching